Hey, welcome back. It's 922, just like promised, right after the commercial break. We're talking about some of the great things that you can do moms with your kids when it comes to exercise. I, Kara Babcock is with me here Hello. this morning. It's interesting because so many moms, once you have a kid, you say, I, I can't exercise, I don't have time to exercise, but yeah. you say, oh no, you can include <laughs> them, right? Exactly, there's so many things you can do whether it be at home or since it's going to be nice out today and tomorrow, you can take your stroller outside and your little yeah. ones inside and incorporate your little ones. So I have my daughter here who's one and a half and my son who's four. So we're going to show you a few things you can do at home um, or outside with Let's your little see ones. It. So something you can do, very, very simple. If you've got your stroller or if you're doing dishes, which we all love to do, yes. right? I hate um, dishes, by the way. <laughs> exactly, right? <laughs> Who likes them? So you might as well get something out of it, you know? Right. So you're washing dishes with your stroller and just do some calf raises. So this is gonna help those booties, which we all wanna do. Yes. So just raise up those heels. Can you show them how you can do calf raises too? Oh, are you gonna get <laughs> I know. <laughs> so just raise up those heels. If you're with your stroller, just hold on to the back of that and kind of use it as a bar. If you're doing dishes, same thing. The next thing we're gonna do is actually get in front of the stroller. Can you help me, Everett? All right, we're gonna do <laughs> squats, okay? So you can get in front of your little ones, you can make it fun. So you can just go do peekaboo squats. Hey, you know what, Kara? I don't see you. Come over here real quick. I'm we don't sorry. see. Go on this side. Go on okay. this side to do it. All right. So we're gonna do peekaboo squats. So you're gonna be in front of your little ones and just peekaboo and squat up and down, and that's gonna give you a little bit of cardio and work those. Good job, buddy. And work those booties. Next up, this kind of takes you back to gym class, and we we're all in elementary school, and he loves to do them. So we're gonna do them. And what I like to do is, if you have to change a diaper do five jumping jacks, oh. okay? We have to change a lot of diapers yeah. or if they have to go potty. So can we show them old school jumping jacks? Yeah. Can we do some old school jumping jacks? Good. And they yeah. like to do it. And as we were saying, when they learn that fitness can be fun when yes. they're little, it'll always hopefully be fun for them. It's something you can do with your friends. And now we're gonna take Miss Lila out of her stroller. We're gonna show you how to work those arms so we can all get really well, strong arms. And don't okay? you know that like holding a child just in general. <laughs> exactly. We so all, much. We all get that workout holding them anyway. So we're gonna turn her out and we're gonna do some bicep curls oh. with those babies. So here we go, Miss Lila. Ooh. And I'm, does she look happy, not happy, happy? Yes, yeah, she's good. She's hanging out. And then if you do want to do a weighted squat. So let's all go down with oh Lila. My goodness. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Great job, guys. And the last one, we're gonna put her on the ground here. And this is something for especially new moms um, to always consider. Yeah. Stay away from crunches, new moms. We all get diastasis recti and we have those babies, which is a separation of our abdominal muscles. <laughs> so we just wanna go. <laughs> she's showing you, making sure you know that she's talking right? about bellies. So we just go into planks. <laughs> for new moms, always stay yeah. on those knees. And then we all do planks. So family yeah. planks. Good job. We all do it together. <laughs> Good job. All right, and then we're gonna pop I back love up that. and make it kind of a jump. Yay! <laughs> do you know what I love? I feel like my, my husband and I talk about this a lot about how important fitness is and showing kids that it's good to yes. be physically active. Yeah. And I honestly, I include my daughter in as many workouts as I can, even if she's just yeah. over there watching Moana <laughs> while I'm lifting weights. It's no big deal. I agree, because if they see you being active, then they know it's something positive, and especially when we're all stuck inside right now, yes. even if you can just you know, do some running in place and yeah. get your heart rate going, and it burns energy, which I think if we have toddlers, we all know yes. how great that is to burn energy. And <laughs> really quickly, Kara, tell me about Baby Boot Camp, which is your business, yes. which is what you do. Yeah, I teach Baby Boot Camp, which is a stroller fitness program for moms and kids. So it's ages six weeks when you're released to work out, all the way up to four or five years old. We have classes um, in ha all over Hamilton County. So I it's love a great it. way to have a good supportive group of moms and get fit and yeah. have fun with your kids. And you can read more about a, a fun little idea for working out that she had on Indie Moms blog right now. Kara, thank you so thank much. Thank you. All Say right. thanks, guys. Scott.